I usually sing with my kids, so they'll be they'll be playing G A B G A B G, and I'll sing that with them. And last night I was teaching a child an angel because it was Halloween, so she was dressed as an angel, and she turned and said, "Stop!" Non angelically, "Stop!" Every time you try to help, you just confuse me. The little, little kid's like seven, and it's true. You may have a wonderful method that works with nine of your kids and it gets them to understand and it gets them to hear it and it gets them to see it and it gets them to play it. And that 10th kid, it won't work for. So I'm here supporting you, telling you that you may have to be the most creative person in the world for that 10th kid and figure out what it is that he or she needs and what it is that he or she is not getting. Because it will happen to you that there's going to be a something that they're just not getting, that some child is just not getting. And so I hope that I've helped you out with some tips to try and, and use in your tool bag. What can you use to reach those kids that are not getting it? Don't lose hope though. It, it, there is there is light at the end of the tunnel. They'll get it eventually. My name is Hope Wells and you have been watching expertvillage.com where experts from around the world gather to meet at your desktop.